going on, guys? Chris here with Fandra.com. So today was Google I.O., and uh, Google basically showed off a bunch of new features headed uh, or that's going to be released in the next version of Android, uh, still known as Android O. So now a couple months ago, they released the Android O uh, developer preview. But that was only a very early version of the software. It was only alpha, and it wasn't available via the Android beta program. Today, all that changes. They finally have the beta ready, and it's super easy to install. So I'm going to show you guys exactly how you can download and install it to your uh, Nexus or Google Pixel device. Uh, super simple. So all you have to do is go to android.com backslash beta, uh, which you probably can't really see it on my computer screen here, but once you go there, you're going to sign into your account, super duper easy. It's going to explain to you how the Android O beta program works. Uh, basically, you're going to receive an over-the-air update uh, once you enroll your device. And um, from then on out, you'll keep receiving uh, more Android beta releases for Android O up until the stable, regular Android O, the final build, is ready for everybody. And that will also hit your device over the air. So you just basically have to kick back. You don't have to worry about anything. Uh, eventually you will get that stable version. Uh, along the way, you basically get to test out Android O before anyone else. So to enroll, you just click, you look for your eligible devices here, which are basically Nexus 5X, uh, 6P, Google Pixel, Nexus Player, uh, Pixel C, those types of devices. Um, and then all you do is click enroll device. And then from there, uh, you sit back and wait for the notification to pop up on your Android device or your Nexus or Pixel device and you'll see Android system update. It'll say you have a system update available, just like it was any other system update, and it explains to you that this is the Android beta program. Uh, update size is pretty big, so click download and install. This will download and install it to the device, of course, and um, it should probably take a while because this is actually a major, um, pretty major update. 900, almost a gig. Uh, and from there, we just sit back and we wait until it is finished. Um, from there, it's going to install, reboot the device, and then you will be now enrolled in the Android O beta. Now, should you decide to ever go back and um, you don't want to be in the beta program anymore and you want to get out and just go right back to a normal Android um, stable version, just go back to android.com backslash beta and unenroll your device. Now, unlike the Android O update or when you updated to the beta, which didn't wipe any of your device, all your information and data gets uh, carried on over. When you unenroll, it's gonna wipe your device clean, so you will be starting fresh. Um, so if you decide you do wanna go back and just go right back to the stable version of Android, just make sure you uh, back up all your data, photos, text messages, whatever it is that you need to back up, um, and then you can unenroll and just go right back to a stable release. Uh, yeah, that's how you can enroll in the Android O beta program and uh, download and install Android O. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.